All right, so when you turn the light on, your circuit is tripping. So this is gonna be a very short one. I have been doing this for years now, where I just show up to customer's place where they try to troubleshoot the issue and pretty much it's just overlooked many times. And we're gonna talk about the can lights. So there are many times uh, people will have it throughout their living room or kitchen. It's essentially one switch controlling multiple lights can lights essentially pretty much uh, something like this, looking like where you essentially uh, screw on the light bulb inside of this can light. Okay, sometimes people do a uh, conversion. Uh, instead of using the light bulbs, they will just buy these recess lights. So both of them essentially. And a lot of times people use these kind of light bulbs that are LED, which uh, compared to like traditional uh, light bulbs, I mean, these are a bunch of uh, diets inside of the light, uh, pretty much. And when it burns out, it might cause a short. So a lot of people, what, what they do, they just look at the breaker, they just look at the pretty much uh, a switch, trying to fix the switch or replace the switch, thinking that the problem could be the switch, or they look for a short anywhere but the light bulb itself. So how you can do that? So turn the switch off, turn the breaker off, keep the electrical circuit off, and go through the light bulbs. So most of you already know uh, which light switch controls how many lights in your area. Let's say if it's a kitchen, there could be like four light bulbs. Remove all the light bulbs, okay? Go back, turn the circuit back on, okay? And then come back, flip the switch on. So if your switch turns on and stays on without tripping the circuit, because you're going to go back, take a look at the breaker. And if breaker is still remains on after flipping the switch on and but you don't have any load, essentially, you don't have any light bulbs attached. So what you're going to do is just go one by one. Uh, if you want to test which light bulb causing the issue, you're just going to go uh, mount one light bulb on and then go back flip the switch on if it stays on you're going to mount the second light bulb and so on until you identify that one particular light bulb that went bad and causing the circuit to trip so this is just very quick video and it may not be your situation you might have a little bit different um problem in the circuit but this is very common where i have seen where this light bulb situation and even these like resist they were causing the circuit to trip especially like there are a lot of times right now uh pretty much new buildings are getting uh newer this type of uh, arc fault ground fault uh breakers that are very sensitive and they trip when they sense something small like this so yeah if it helps don't forget to like subscribe if you have question you can definitely comment below and whenever i have time i'll definitely respond uh to your question so that's the video that's um uh, something that you can do hope it helps thanks for watching